So today I'm gonna do a large family grocery haul with a little bit of a twist. So I thought I'd share what it's been like as a large family to find things. So we've been doing online ordering, lots of pickup, things like that. channel everybody so today I'm gonna do a large family grocery haul with a little bit of a twist so I know a lot of you have had trouble finding things at your local grocery stores things like that I think we're all going through that right now so I thought I'd share what it's been like as a large family to find things and one of the difficulties that we've come across lately is having to go to multiple places or having to order from multiple places. So we've been doing online ordering, lots of pickup, things like that. We've done three different grocery stores and the first one is Sam's Club. So we were picking up, today is, today's Wednesday. So we did our first order last night. Well, we did all of our orders last night, but we were able to pick up our first order today. So it's Wednesday when we're picking up our very first order for the week, and that's from Sam's Club. So we did their fax and poll. You can hear the kids playing the game in the background. Anyway, let's get into the haul. And this first part of the haul was about $130. Um, but it's a lot of bulk items like bulk meat and stuff like that So don't forget if you like videos like this give it a big thumbs up and click that subscribe button If you haven't already and click the bell for notifications so you don't miss when any of our videos upload Okay, so <laughs> This is it guys. This is hundred and thirty dollars. So it seems like a lot but when you take into account that the price of the meat was $83, we actually got a really good deal on what we have here. So we got a prime rib to cut up into steaks for the family. So this will last for quite a while. This will probably do about 20 steaks and it'll do quite a few meals. And then I've been looking for vitamin C. I could not find it anywhere and they finally had some in. So I got these Power C gummies and it came as a two pack. I've already opened them. There's 150 in each one. So I've got 300 gummies. That was a really good deal. And then this one, I opened it so the kids could have some, but the whole wrapper came off. So I can't even remember what brand this is, but this was also a really good deal. And it's a nice bulk buy. I'll probably continue to do that. And then I needed OxyClean for laundry. And this was about, I think about $16, but this will last for a really long time. It says 252 loads. I'll probably get a lot more than that out of this. So yeah, and laundry things, stuff like that. I'm sure a lot of you have seen it's hard to get those things like what you want. So I was really excited to finally be able to get some OxyClean. Okay, so now this is the next day. So this is Thursday and this is what we picked up. It was $37.59. We shopped our local Hy-Vee store and we ended up picking up, these are like six pack bottles of Mountain Dew. We picked up four of those. And then we got two of the 12 packs of Diet Coke, and you can see my husband already broke into those. Um, they have been out of cases lately, so, and I know it's not a priority, but they were able to substitute for 12 packs, so that was kind of nice. Lately, you hadn't been able to get a lot of times more than one 12 pack, and they did give us two instead of the case, which was nice. And then we were able to get some bread, which was really awesome. They had three mm -hmm. loaves of bread there. And then we got two things of, um, potatoes and a big tub of butter. This has been impossible to get. I was so excited that they finally had some butter in. And then um, three things of lettuce. So we'll do, this is more for like sandwiches and um, tacos. So that's what we picked up the three for. So it was nice to be able to get some produce. Um, that's what I'm hoping. We're going to be putting in one more Sam's Club order this week. Um, and I'm gonna try to get some fresh produce, which would be really All good. right, so this haul, we did a fax and pull through Sam's Club as well. This is a second Sam's Club haul for this week. But, so now it is Saturday, you guys, that we've picked this up. Um, and so this is more of our snack stuff. And I was really excited because we were able to get some stuff that has not been available. So we got a 50 count. Now this order was $189 for all of this, but this is all bulk. So it seems really pricey, but it's because it's bulk. So, um, 
we got a 50 count thing of the crunchy Cheetos and a 50 count of the Doritos as well. And then two 16 count white hot dog buns and then two 16 count white hamburger buns. And then some Orita golden crinkle fries. And then I don't even know how many, I think this is, yeah, two pounds of strawberries. I've been wanting some fresh produce for the kids. So we got that and then five pounds of the cuties. A big thing of sour cream. Now they were out of the big tubs of cottage cheese that we had ordered. So um, that is one thing we did not get on our order. We got um, a 24 pack of the mandarin orange cups and five pounds of cheddar and Monterey Jack cheese. So this was a little bit better deal. They have like three different kinds of the five pounds, but the cheddar and Monterey Jack is a little bit cheaper. So that, for us, that's what we pick up because that's always the better deal. I think it's cheaper by like two or three dollars. And then this is for my husband. He absolutely loves all beef hot dogs and our son Zane. Zane is a big hot dog guy. So they got an 80 count thing of um, beef franks and then Matt will separate these up and we'll stock our freezer with these. And then two 18 packs of brats because it's coming into grilling season. We are a big grilling family and Matt just ordered himself a new grill so he's super excited for her move. If you didn't know already, we are getting ready to move soon. So there should be um, a new house tour coming up. Anyway, he'll package these up as well separately so this is more freezer freezer storage bulking up and then two of the uh, meat packets that they have and I love these because they come in two packs so what we usually do is we'll cut them and then we'll keep one out and we'll freeze one because these freeze really well um, we got the ham and then the turkey the only thing I'm not able to get is the chicken and that's my favorite they don't carry that at Sam's so I usually have to go somewhere else to get my chicken and then this is of course for our kids. I don't know, I like these two though, so I'll eat them. We got a 32 count of the Yoplait Go-Gurts. I usually get Moo Tubes at Aldi's, but right now I haven't been shopping at Aldi's due to the coronavirus, so we haven't been trying to go into as many stores as possible. Anyway, we have been trying to minimize where we've been going in, so one of the things we've been doing is just doing like online and store pickups and already having it prepared. So. We've not been getting our groceries by going into stores. The only store I've been going into is the Dollar Tree and I try to keep that to like maybe once every three weeks if I can help it, once a month. And then this is for my husband. He loves his Diet Coke and this was a pretty good deal. I can't remember exactly what the price was on it, but it was a good price. Um, and he got the 35 can pack, so that should last him for a while. This was gold, you guys. <laughs> we actually found toilet paper. I saw a bunch of people coming out. We hadn't ordered it because you can't order it online. Um, but there were a bunch of people coming out as I went in to go pick up my order. And <laughs> I was like, do you by any chance have toilet paper I could get? And the lady was super nice. And she's like, yeah, you want me to send somebody to get it? And they did. And I was able to get toilet paper. So this has been gold. I was excited to get a pack of toilet paper, you guys. I can't... <laughs> I can't even explain like how weird it is to be excited over toilet paper, but I'm sure you know if you've been going through this. So this just came from the post office today, so we also did some Amazon ordering, and because we've been buying meat in bulk, Matt wanted to make sure that he had some freezer paper, so I thought I'd kind of show you guys some of the shopping haul that we've also had to do online since we're not going to the stores very often. Um, so he got some freezer paper and then freezer tape, but he said this was a really good deal and there's actually a lot in here so i actually had a hard time finding freezer tape and paper in the store you just couldn't get it and there's four four or five rolls in here so that's awesome we won't need it for quite some time now and i think it was like 19 dollars, maybe 16 or 19 for this whole order something like that so i'm laughing a little bit because matt's like i don't know we ordered shampoo it says out for delivery it was in the mailbox he didn't realize it was there so this was the other thing that we got um some activated charcoal shampoo and conditioner which normally we buy this at sally's beauty supply and it was actually cheaper to order it on amazon so i think it was like 16 dollars for this two pack not yeah. even no oh no it was more like four it yeah. was 14. it was 14 for the two pack and then how much was it for this honey uh, all the other, it was like 18 bucks. Yeah, so it was like $18 for this, and it was like 14, 12 or $14 for the activated charcoal. Well, so, that's a lot of paper, though. Yeah. So this was 
our total Amazon order so far. There's a few things that are on back order, but this is what we got in today. Okay, so this is the last of our online ordering for this week. Um, one was a curbside order, so you basically call it in and then they set it out on the curb. You pay for it ahead of time, they set it out on the curb and then you just pick it up. As soon as you get there, they put it outside their door. So this is Walmart and this is an online pickup order that we did. So I put this in, it was almost a week ago. It takes, it takes about six days to get your order right now um, through Walmart and you just go and park your car if you've ever done their curbside pickup park your car and they bring it out and they'll load it for you and then this part of our order is from sally's and they also do a curbside pickup and that's where they set it outside the door and then you just grab it <laughs> once you get there so it was very unusual it was different to do it today okay so our walmart order was about 111 dollars. there were some things we were not able to get and then they did some substitution so um, like there was some yarn I couldn't get that I wanted to get for um, knitting and stuff like that. But I'll tell you guys about that as we go through the haul. So um, this is for my kids and me and Matt. <laughs> we all love these. And this is the first time in over a month I've been able to pick these up. So my kids are really excited. They've already broke into these. Um, and they're the Walmart brand Tangy Fruit Smiles. These are their absolute favorite fruit snacks. And I usually always try to get the Mega Pack, and they actually did have it in, so I was pretty happy to get that. This is for mostly myself and Brax, and this is our favorite. We love Miracle Whip, and I got the value size, but I did find that I can order it um, cheaper on Sam, so that's where we'll be picking it up from now on, but I picked some up today at Walmart. Um, this is French Onion Dip. We got two of those. And then we picked up two gallons of milk. So right now that's pretty much all you can order through Walmart is two gallons. They won't let you get any more than that. And we actually go through a lot more than that in our family. So we'll probably do a high V order this week and order some more um, because we just have such a large family. Two gallons of milk doesn't really cut it. And then this was one of the substitutions. I'd actually ordered something cheaper, so this was nice. They'll do the upgrade for you if they don't have something. And they're still doing it during this time, which was really nice. Um, they gave us the Deli Deluxe American single slices and two packages of those. So this was actually a really good savings. And then I got one bag of the Fruity Dino Bites. I think I'd ordered two, but they only gave me one. So I'll probably have to order some more cereal yet this week again. Um, and then this was one of my substitutions. I generally get the great value brand of the drink mixes because I like where my kids aren't drinking as much soda and stuff. So we ordered these, but I wasn't able to get a lot of the flavors we normally do for the kids. So they did substitute this for the Crystal Light. I've not had this. I've not usually been a big Crystal Light fan, but I am going to try it and see if I like it because I do like Fruit Punch. So they gave us three of those and then... We got three of the lemonades, three of the grape, three of the orange early rise, and then three of the raspberry lemonade. And these will actually last us for a while. I like to stock up on these when I can get them. I'll keep a back stock in our long-term food storage. And then this was gold because it's been really hard to find baking supplies. And I was able to get 25 pounds of sugar. So I grabbed one of those to put in our long-term food storage. And then um, we got potato chips just for a treat for the kids. These will probably be devoured today, you guys, in all honesty. And then this is also for the kids. Um, I got pink lemonade. Now they did have to substitute some of the flavors they didn't have, so I don't even know, like, I can't even remember what was substituted. Maybe like substituted, like maybe a black cherry or something. I don't know. Um, but they had, oh, you know what? I think it was actual lemonade flavor. They had pink lemonade, cherry, Blue Raspberry Lemonade, which this is one of my kids' favorites, and then Sharkleberry Fin. So um, I think I had originally said four of each, and I ended up with extra of these ones, and these ones, and these ones. So I don't remember what substitutions they gave me. Now this is because I bought two packages of these big knitting needles. I'm actually teaching some of my kids to knit, and myself as well, because I didn't know how and I decided to be something fun for us to learn. And then I got 60 gallon freezer bags. These are because we've been doing a lot of um, meat packaging and then like I'll buy cheese in bulk and I'll package them in gallon freezer bags and freeze shredded cheese. So um, 
These are for our knitting as well. I just got a really cheap basic yarn to practice with because we're not experienced. And I figured we'd wait to get some of the nicer yarns until we are. But these were really cheap. They were like a dollar, I think like a dollar ninety-seven a piece for the yarn. And then I got two of these. I had actually ordered three, but they were out. I got a cherry berry. These are like those wax melts. I love these. And then tropical fiesta. I think I had a white peach mango that I had ordered, um, but they were out of that one. Now this, this was a substitution they gave us. Um, and it's a Norelco razor. And I think these are normally like $50. And we had ordered a head clippers, like a hair clippers, um, which was like a wall one for like $19. And they, substitu they substituted it for this, which it was a good deal for us, so we'll use this. We decided to keep it and like not worry about saying, hey, you know, that's not what we ordered because we got the better end of the deal. So um, we ended up just going with it. But that made my husband have to order through Sally's because he wants to give the kids haircuts and himself. So he ordered this. Now this, okay, so our Sally's order was $97 for these few things, but we ordered this and it says reduced $54.99. So this was a $150 clipper. And the reason it was reduced is because nobody liked the colors on it, you guys. So nothing wrong with it. It's like the expensive one, but it was the colors that made it get reduced by $100. So we got a steal on this. Like this is a professional grade clipper. And if you didn't know, my husband went to school um, to do hair so he was pretty excited to get this clippers and then he ordered himself a new pair of shears so he could give trims haircuts some of the nicer styles for any of the kids that wanted them and then his super expensive 38 cent comb and this is for him a tea tree oil shampoo and it's like the generic version of paul mitchell but he said it's just as good all right i hope you guys have enjoyed this haul video that we did to show you kind of how it's been for us as a large family to order food and have to order online and do pickups, how it's been very different from us than our normal orders. And if you like this video, don't forget to click the subscribe button and click that bell so you'll get all the notifications and give it a big thumbs up.